Hello everyone, welcome, my name is MJ Pestridge, welcome to another Sim Market review, a spotlight review for under 5 minutes, and today we are looking at a Golden Age plane from Golden Age Simulations, the Ryan Broman. It's a series uh, of single engine, five or six seater airlines, which was developed by the US American manufacturer, Ryan Aeronautical Company, and produced by BF Mahoney Aircraft Corporation, and later the Ryan Mahoney Aircraft Corporation. And the Boeing series uh, package here from uh, Golden Age Simulation is priced 27 euros. And uh, this is a release that came out in 2018. And I thought I'd revisit some of their classic planes because in the future, we we may be seeing a complete re remodel, redo of these planes in the future, and this might be like one of the last chances to grab these classic ones, which are ready for prepared uh, versions 1 to 4, I guess, and FSX. It comes with 2K high resolution liveries, fully animated virtual cockpits with virtual cockpit shadowing and smooth 3D modeling gauges. So if we hop in the flight deck here, this is what it looks like. It's a very old vintage plane. Um, it also comes complete with a series of cargo setups, depending on which one you fly. There are also a ski version and a, um, a float plane version of these. Uh, all of them are modeled in high, uh, fully animated, high quality 3D models. There's multiple configurations, like I said, so you can have passenger, bush cargo, or just a solo flight. Uh, there's volumetric propeller textures, high definition uh, sounds, precision flight dynamics, and a fully animated pilot figures. Uh, I really recommend it, it is a really, interesting plane to fly and uh, we're going to do a little flight in this real quick just to sort of see what she's about so um we're going to need to get her going here so let me start this uh, mixture up one thing i like about this is it comes with a little pilot bag here which uh you can bring up your map to show you where you are you can also bring up a checklist so you can start the plane up properly and it does actually come with a full checklist here um, which is pretty cool and then obviously comes with its own little GPS system radio transmitter down here but we're basically just gonna go off the grace of God here and have a fly around and see see what she's about so let's uh, take her to the skies oh dear uh, I just remembered something actually hit the brakes left the door open that would help, wouldn't it? Let's close that door, mate. There we go. All right, now we can go. Yeah, no wonder it was a bit loud in the flight deck. But he... Right. We're here in Hawaii. We're going to have a little fly around. Uh, let me just put some yellow pages under my bum. you see where I'm going. And uh, let's see what she's about. This is a really classic plane now. Like I said, it was designed back in 2018. So it was designed for prepared version 1 to 3, I guess, really. 1 to 4, maybe, in FSX in mind. So uh, I'm flying it in version 5 here, so it may look slightly different um, than what you'll have. But uh, it is highly recommended. I, I don't know where the runway is. It's highly recommended. It, this is a runway here. Let's take off. It's really a short field takeoff here, so you don't really have to worry about runway length. So let's get on this runway. Is this a runway? Do you know what? I'm using it as a runway. It don't matter if it is or it isn't. Let's go. Beautiful. Um, like I said, the, the, this may be... Uh, obviously, the, ga the gear is fixed. It doesn't come up, so it is what it is. But um, like I said, this, this may, may be, uh, in the future, come with a... Um, a future upgrade to these planes like to see this in version 5 and version 6 fully modeled uh, with enhanced textures and enhanced modeling animations would be awesome uh, especially in version 6 with what's available there 
Um, I think that this plane would look amazing and be a real classic to fly because there is no real VOR navigation on board. There's no radio navigation properly. You, if you've got a GPS, that's great. But other than that, you are flying as it is. Like you have no boneless salt. Oh gosh, we better get this going. Uh, you've got no way of sort of navigating around the world except for your own eyeballs. So you, um, yeah, it, it's a really interesting plane to, to fly. So this is um, developed with accuracy in appearance and performance in mind. The Golden Age Simulations B5 is presented, like I said, in land pl uh, land wheels, land ski, and float plane configurations. The options include high resolution liveries representing operators that have known to have used the B5, as well as others that may not, but have wished they had. The simulator pilot has the options of flying the aircraft fully laden with passengers or cargo or just a solo flight. The aircraft is fully animated with custom animations that include operable exterior cockpit vents, roller blinds, tool tips are active for all animated parts as well, and it is a real pleasure to fly. Uh, even in, the, in this raw state in V5 where it's seriously not designed for, like this is a really nice GA sort of plane to fly, accurately modeled. The texture is quite highly detailed. Um, I find this really interesting and um, totally worth picking up. Um, oh yeah, Hawaii, man. Always a pleasure to fly around Hawaii. Um, yeah, really recommend going to get it, guys. Really recommend to go get it. This is truly a fun plane to fly. It looks fantastic and it flies fantastic. And I, I like I said, you know, go pick it up. It's available on Sim Market. The link is in the description box below. And that's basically all I have to say about this plane because it is actually a really nice plane to fly. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching this. Uh, don't forget, I give 50 euros of Sim Market vouchers away every single month. If you want to be in with a chance to win 50 euros where you can spend on flight sim add-ons on the Sim Market website, just be a subscriber to my channel and put a comment down in any one of my P3D videos. And when I go live at the end of every month, I'll announce the giveaway winner. Thank you very much, and I'll see you in the next review, guys. Bye.